Hi everyone, my name is Christy and welcome to my trying a new makeup product everyday series. So today I am excited to be trying out a product from a brand that I'm not familiar with. It's called Trifle Cosmetics. However, this is in my opinion one of the least exciting products for me to try out and to get in my beauty subscription boxes because it's just a black liquid liner. It's called the Lava Liner in the shade Molasses and I got it in my January 2023 Ipsy Glam bag, which of course I have that unboxing video up here on my YouTube channel, which you should definitely check out if you haven't seen it yet. But so this is a full size product. It retails for $10 and we're going to see how it is. It's supposed to be long lasting, waterproof. I do really like this packaging because it's got cupcakes all over it, which is cute. When I shake it, it literally makes no noise. There isn't, seems like there's nothing in here. <laughs> it's a felt tip liner, which is pointy. Let's do a swatch. Wow, it definitely writes like a marker. It's a flexible felt tip, so it doesn't seem like it's gonna poke the eye. Goes on with good pigment. A dark black color. So it seems nice so far. And $10, I feel like is a pretty reasonable price point for a black liquid liner. And okay, I'm gonna go ahead and line my upper lash line. I am not great at liquid liner, but that might make it even better for me to test it out because we'll see how user friendly it is. <laughs> I mean, it is actually pretty easy. Let's see if I can get right on the lash line. Yeah. It is pretty easy to use. You can get a smooth line, you can get a thick line or a very skinny line. I like that I can get right onto that lash line because I don't like when there's that separation between the lash line and the eyeliner. So yeah, it seems nice. It does kind of feel like it's drying out a little bit though as I'm using it. So I'll go ahead and try it on the other eye and see if it is drying out at all. But before I do, I want to see if there's any smudging. Ooh, very nice. No smudging at all. It really is going to stay in place like it claimed, which is great. But yeah, let's see how it is now on the other eye. If it has, oh yeah, it actually has dried out. It's not going on with as much ink. And that's kind of concerning because I only just opened this. I was only able to do one eye so far and it's already going on like with no pigment. I have to go over it a lot. And as I'm going over, it's kind of erasing itself since it's not going on with pigment because it already feels dried out. It's weird and it's like I can't really shake it because there's like nothing in here let's see yeah maybe by pressing down that's what brings more ink to the tip <laughs> but that's not great that makes it a lot harder to use it so yeah I mean <laughs> what else is there to say about it 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 dries out, but you can get a full black color that is not going to smudge. This eye where it was drying out looks actually really bad. It's really messy. It's uneven. So like patchy. So like this eye was really good. This one, not good. <laughs> so let me know if you've tried it out, how it is for you. But this does look like a cute brand when I was looking on their website. So I'd like to try some of the other products that I think I would find a little bit more exciting. So if you've tried any other Trifle Cosmetics products, definitely let me know in the comments down below how those were. But thank you so much for watching my video today. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel so you can see the makeup that I try every day. And I will see you tomorrow in my next video.